Welcome to this tutorial on AliCAD Linear Dimensions. Before dimensioning a drawing, it is a good idea to set up the dimension styles. If you have not already done so, check out our tutorial on dimension styles. To add linear dimensions, go to Dimensions, Linear. You will see that there are three options available, Aligned, Vertical and Horizontal. We will use all three methods to demonstrate how they work. The horizontal and vertical methods work very similarly. The linear dimensions may be drawn using a running, chained or free style. We will start with the running style. The spacing for how far the dimensions are drawn apart is set under Settings, Dimension Styles in the Lines tab. Here you can set the spacing. Select Dimension, Linear, Horizontal and click on the running radio button. The point snap is immediately activated. Indicate the first point and then the next point. Indicate the offset of the dimension away from the drawing and click to insert it. Continue to click over the points requiring dimensioning and you will see the dimensions are added. To end the function, right click and select cancel to end the current dimensioning and continue from a new point or quit to end the function completely. We will now use the chain style. Select Dimension, Linear, Vertical and click on the Chained radio button. Indicate the first point by clicking on it and then the next point. Indicate the offset of the dimension away from the drawing. Click over the points that require dimensioning. Once finished, right click and select Cancel to end the current dimensioning and continue from a new position or quit to end the function completely. You will notice the one dimension falls inside the other dimensions. This is due to the area being too small. To edit it, select the dimension and click on the node near the text. You can now stretch the dimension out and position it in a new position. Press Escape to clear the selection. The next one we'll look at is the freestyle. Select Dimension, Linear, Horizontal and click on the free radio button. Indicate the first point by clicking on it and then the next point. Indicate the offset of the dimension away from the drawing and click to insert it. You are now prompted to indicate the first point again. If the area you are dimensioning is too small to position the text inside the arrows, the dimension will be placed on whichever side you position the mouse. If you select the text overwrite option, you will be prompted to overwrite the text once the dimension has been placed. Type in the required measurement and press enter to have the dimension inserted. The text overwrite option can be used with either running, chained or free styles and may be edited in the properties bar. Once finished, Right click and select quit to end the function. We have used the horizontal and vertical methods. Finally we will look at the aligned method. Select dimension, linear, aligned. Indicate the first point by clicking on it and then the next point. Indicate the offset away from the drawing and click to have the dimension inserted. The align style can also dimension horizontally and vertically. Right click and select quit to end the function. All the linear dimension methods will work with running, chained and free styles. Thank you for watching this tutorial and visit our website to find out more about AliCAD.